Welcome to Dynamics 365 Bulk Edit. So there's many times in the system where you need to make the same changes to a large number of records, and Bulk Edit is exactly what you need to do in those scenarios. You can run Bulk Edit on most of the entities in the system. There's some that you can't, such as orders or products, um, but for common ones such as accounts and contacts, you're able to run Bulk Edit. So what you could do, you could find a list of accounts and say, actually, this relationship type, we want to start using this, and we want to pull out our customers within this list of accounts, which is a mixture of customers and prospects and suppliers. So what you can do in this list view is you can just select the ones that you want to flag as customers. Let's say we'll go for those five records and you click on edit. It brings out a pop-up form. And for this particular field, this is in the header. So you also get access to the header field as well as the fields on the form. So click on header, change the relationship type to customer, click on save. And it tells you how many it's saving, one, two, three, four, five. And now we can see that we've bulk edited those records. So it's a really quick way to be able to update records. And that could be a drop down list, it could be a date field, it could be a lookup field, um, whatever it might be. Um, but you can quickly edit your records in that way. If we go into the contacts, to show you the same thing again, a different way around, because this time we'll combine some filters. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, okay, we look like we've got some missing cities within here and we want to do some mail outs or um, something else with the data, uh, maybe even a marketing campaign. And we want to um, make sure that we've got London specified for all the WC postcodes. So if I check on the postcode, filter by begins with WC. And then I specify in the filter here that the city does not contain data. I can see I've got two records. Now that could be two records, that could be 22, it could be 222. Um, but the fact is that you could select them all, go for bulk edit, scroll down to city, change that to London, click on save, and you've got your records updated. So it's a fantastic way to also um, improve your data quality, um, to be able to bulk edit records and make changes across several records very, very quickly. Um, and, uh, and with great power comes great responsibility. Just be very mindful of what you're doing with it um, because it will overwrite the data that's in there for the fields you specify. Um, so by that, what I mean is if I just reset the filters here, um, if I was to bulk edit and change the first name field, for example, that would change the first name for all of those four records. So just make sure you're only changing the fields that you do want to change and it will leave all of the others alone. But otherwise, it's a really great way to save time on, uh, on making changes to your data and making sure that you've got good data quality for things like addresses, um, postcodes, and that kind of common uh, contact information.